Hey guys, how's it going? It's 8-Bit Eric. Today we're going to check out a free-to-play Steam game. This is Hargrave. Now this is a retro-style platformer game that's kind of like a sci-fi shooter, but the catch is it's extremely hard. And basically in the vein of retro games where the idea is there's a very, very, very big learning curve, but that's the appeal of it. So this might not be for everybody if you get frustrated and rage quit i thought this would be something fun to go ahead and check out full disclosure this is a sponsored gameplay video but you know we're gonna get right down to brass tacks if you're interested in this game i do have a link down below in the description for you guys to click and check the game out so let's go ahead and uh get started shall we so let's begin in the outer reaches of the galaxy, Hargrave wakes to the sound of warning indicators. Okay, I didn't get to finish reading that, but let's do this. This looks like it's a lot of fun. Look at this, you know, this retro, neo-retro style pixel arts, pixel graphics, pixel sprites. All right, let's do this. All right. seems like the volume is extremely low but that's fine so here we go we got jump in I'm using an Xbox controller by the way oh there we go all right so there's the dash so the the game still shows the keyboard controls there we go all right we are good to go all right, so I guess these are the four levels of the game. All right. It almost kind of reminds me of Mega Man a little bit. Pause any time to return to the warp hub. Oh, shoot. I wonder if you have unlimited lives. It seems like you do. What's this? Is that like a... Oh, I got an achievement, even though I just died grabbing it. Okay. <laughs> Get up there. Oh. Okay. <laughs> this definitely has a Mega Man feel. Um. Oh, I got mashed. Mashed again. Wow, I just got two achievements. Can I do another one? A third one? Ah, oh, there's not a fourth. Jump over the masher. Yeah, thank you for the tip. I don't have a multiple, uh, a multiple way to, uh, to dash. Oh, there, there's the dash. Okay. So the dash works kind of, kind of differently. Oh, gosh. Well, I got some, uh, achievements, which is good. What's, uh... Oh gosh. Wow, this really is a little <laughs> a little difficult, but not in a bad way. It, it definitely feels like like something from the NES as far as control goes. What's this? Did I not get anything for that? My troubles? Okay. 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 Can we go up? Let's go up. Let's figure out what's going up. Okay. Low ceilings. There we go. Okay. Um. Oh, nice. What's that? Max HP? Okay. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Okay, we're just gonna go down. Oh, you could shoot kind of angled up. I did not know that. All right, that that changes everything. And it seems like the uh, the map is just one big um, maze. Oh, 
Oh, watch out. I did not see. Oh, goodness. Here we go. We're just going to go down this way. Okay, how, do, how in the world... How in the world do I get that? <laughs> oh, this is like... Mario Maker times a thousand. Mega Man plus Mario Maker. Use tools of, to bypass spikes. Um, what tools? Okay, that dash is kind of tricky to figure out. <laughs> oh, okay. We're just going to move around. We... Gate requires 30 power cells. How many power cells do I have? It does not... I don't even think I have... I don't even think I have... That many. Okay, there we go. Do I have to actually physically carry the power cell to the gate? Wow. Yo, I could turn the music up. Let's do it. I didn't realize the volume was so low. Let's turn that sucker up, guys, and let's jam out to it. There we go. Let's turn them effects up too. Dang, I died 34 times already. Alright, let's resume the game. Some good music. So I'm wondering if that's a power cell. I'm pretty sure that is. Pretty sure I have to take that to the gate that seems pretty tough oh my gosh <laughs> oh come on Eric stop being a fraud right stop being a fraud that sucks at video games I need 30 Please report malfunction travel belts. Anything really malfunctioning? Oh my gosh. I fell. It's almost like a Metroid game too, because you have to like go back. Galactic Bingo Thursdays have been cancelled. Wow. Jesus Christ. Mother. There we go. Come on. going on I don't even know what's what <laughs> like do I even get to keep that since I died it's definitely a pretty challenging game but it seems like a lot of fun let's go to the hub we're not talking about the hub we're talking about this hub and we're going to let's go to a different world let's see what a different world oh look at this one the music's good I can get behind the music I wonder who made it. Is it Heatley Brothers? Mm. 
You must bring a power cell out of a room to collect. Oh. Okay, now I get it. So these things in the green boxes are power cell. And in order to actually get one, I have to take it out of the room. Like so. So I collected that one. And I guess I needed 30 for the previous stage. Tap, jump quickly, and squeeze through tight spaces. Oop. There we go. Oop. Jesus. Oh my gosh. Tap it! <laughs> oh man, this is NES hard. At least it has unlimited lives. Okay. Tap it. Okay, so there is... Power cell down there. My god, that's gonna be a hard one to get. Should we even bother? Oh, I can kill this? I did not know that. Ah. Oh. <laughs> oh my goodness gracious, great balls of fire. You can angle your shots. Oh, yeah, I have. Oh gosh. All right, we swerp to the hub. <laughs> Let's check out all the stages, because I don't think I'm gonna be good enough to beat all of them. Pause any time to return to the warp hub. Okay, it always says that at the first. Hey, there's some pretty cool music here. Ah, the masher. I didn't even see the masher. I didn't... I jumped. I jumped, buddies. Oh! Come on, dude. Jump! <laughs> God. <laughs> oh, I suck at video games. But yeah, guys, for a free play game, this is not half bad on Steam. Definitely has that, you know, classic Mega Man vibe. Oh, gosh. A little bit Kaizo in its nature, too, but it has that, that Mega Man vibe. Let's go down. Let's see what see what else is in this stage. I'm on board, y'all, with being in the same spot. It is a very tricky game, though. Oh my god! Come on. There we go. I got one. Nice. Blocks need something tougher to break them. Oh, I got a new, uh. I got a new achievement. Please step over the masher. You step over the masher. You step over, you die. Ugh. 
There we go. Oh gosh. I always forget that these things light you up. Sector 3 boss? Whoa, I wasn't expecting a boss. Expecting a boss. Whoa, shit. This game does not fool around, guys. <laughs> Can I beat one thing in this game? I think this might inspire some of you guys to wanna to wanna play it for sure because it has that old school vibe. My God. Oh, I beat it. Holy cow. <laughs> New weapon created. I did not think I was going to beat that. Wow. Okay, so we got a new weapon. And I can rotate. Okay, so that gives me the thing to defeat, to destroy those red blocks. Sector 3 challenge room. Shoot. Oh gosh. You gotta remember. There's only certain stuff that you could. Oh my god. Why, why do I have a challenge room right after a boss? <laughs> was, was the boss fight not enough? Well, at least I beat the boss, right? You know? Can't take that away from me. Can we go to the hub? Do I still have my... Oh, yes. I still have my gun. All right. I still have my weapon. Oh, and it, it auto... Oh, good. It, it homes in. It's a homing missile. Sweet. So that makes things a lot easier. <laughs> <clears throat> That only makes things a lot easier. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Alright guys, this has been a very interesting little game, honestly. I'm digging it. Again, it's free in Steam if you go and download it. <clears throat> it's called Hardgrave. I believe that's what it's called, how you pronounce it. But yeah, Hardgrave. Free to play game. Has an old school Mega Man vibe. I dig it. Again, I have a link in the description down below should you guys want to download it and play it. Let me know your thoughts on the game. I'll see you guys later. Y'all have a good one.
Peace out.